how I curl my hair. So the first thing you need is of course hair tie. If you have thick hair like me, you need to separate your hair and uh, yeah, separate it into two or three. Um, yeah, like my hair, I usually separate it into three parting if I am not rushing. But if I'm rushing, I usually um, part it into two parts. So yeah, you actually need two of these so you can separate the curls and also the ones that are not done yet. The next thing you need is a straightener and yes I use a straightener to curl my hair because I don't own a curler and I don't know how to use a curler so I'm using this. This is a Philips. I've been using it for almost four years. Yep, four years and counting. Okay, I'm gonna section my hair. I'm gonna section it into two. Tie a bun so it gets out of the way, which doesn't really help. Okay, and after this, I'd separate it into like two sides. Okay, and just comb it. So what you're gonna do is take the back part first. Okay, just take about this much. It doesn't really matter actually. If you want smaller curl, then just take a little bit. If you want bigger curls, take more. But this is a good size. <laughs> this is a good size to use the straightener actually. Ow. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it from the top, pull it down, and then you twist one whole circle. So now you're seeing this part, so you gotta see that part again. You gotta hold this bottom part though. Yeah. And then just pull it down. You're gonna see like a little smoke, but it's fine. See, I got a curl. Okay, wait. Oops. Wrong side. Okay. Just push it back. And take another piece. And then hold this. Make sure you always hold this. Don't let your hair come out from the iron. Because that is not going to be good. You want to alternate between going in and out. So, okay, for example, now I'm going to go in. So I'm turning my straightener inwards towards my face. So this is going in. And then the next trend I'm gonna do it outwards, which means it's turning that way. So I'm gonna turn it outwards away from my face. And pull. Don't feel that touch. So don't break the curls yet, it smells good. And yeah, once it's done, then we try to break the curls. Okay, I gotta be fast here, so I'm gonna go fast. Same thing on the other side, take a little bit, twist, twist, twist. Before you take this one off, 
you want to tie the curls that you've already done so that you don't mix it with the ones that are not okay and then I'm gonna take out this one I'm kind of rushing today so I'm gonna only do two part thing I'm gonna do two parts so I like middle parting separate it into two Get it from the back. Twist. Try not to let the smoke hit your fingers because it's hot. This one is a tiny one. You see, if you do it smaller, this is what you get. It's hot. Some of you asked me if you're gonna get damaged hair by doing this. I would say, of course, you're putting direct heat on your hair. So maybe you wanna put some, I don't know, some hair heat protector or something. I don't because if you can see my hair is already dead so I don't really care what color should I do my hair next I want it to be super classy I usually hold these ends so the curls like ha ah, so pretty for those of you asking me where did I color my hair I did it in hair color expert in Damansara uptown um, you gotta you gotta go to their app like in, download their app install their app whatever and then you gotta set an appointment so once you set an appointment just go there and yeah tell them what you want and they will before you even start they will let you know the price and if you're okay with the price you can go ahead and do it if not then don't do it so yeah they're pretty good yeah i got my pretty ombre there which cost me about 600 But the only thing there is they only they only do coloring so they don't cut your hair they don't they don't i don't know for me they didn't do treatment so i'm not sure why but yeah they didn't do treatment for me but i bought the i bought their color shampoo which actually is not that bad because my hair color lasted for almost five months yeah and you know grey doesn't last that long but mine does and I still have the shampoo with me so yeah I, I recommend you guys who have virgin black hair to go to hair color expert and yeah do it And if you ever want to go and style your hair and curl your hair, I would suggest you to go to Sean Cutler in Bangsar. Yeah. And find for Mavis. She's an amazing hairstylist. She did my hair for Miss Universe Finals in Bangkok. Yeah, she's amazing. Don't feel me to touch Don't stop Without a fire Don't hold another kiss Okay, guys, this is This is tiring 
Okay, the last bit of hair. Come on. Don't expect yourself to be good at this on your first try because it took me so, not really long, but a few months to actually be a professional like this. I remember doing it um, the first few times. I learned from YouTube, so I did it the first few times and yeah, it didn't work out. And I remember I had to like wet my hair again so it goes back straight to my original hair. Yeah, so it took some time. So yeah, it took me some time. And yeah, just keep practicing. Some of you even ask me how long does the curl last. Um, it depends on your hair. If it's your original hair, it lasts longer. But for me nowadays, it doesn't even last half a day. Because my hair is dead and it doesn't want to listen to <laughs> what I want. So yeah, it doesn't really last. For me, it doesn't last. But you can always use products on your hair, like um, hairspray or, you know, like hair gel or whatever that's called. Ow! Okay, last one. The last bit, the ones that, that are like on my face, I usually do it outwards because sometimes it doesn't work. Yeah, so I usually do it outwards like that. See, it doesn't turn out, so I gotta do it again. Oh, it's hot. And then my stupid fringe that I decided to cut. I can't wait for this to grow, man. Because I don't know how to style it. Okay, so that's it. I am sweating like a pig. So now I'm going to take up this hair tie that we tied. Okay. And I am done. And I'm done with my curls. There it is. I don't really use any products, so I'm just gonna leave it like this. And um, if your hair stays curly all the time, then you break it. But if you, your hair's like mine, that doesn't last, the curls doesn't last, just leave it like this, it will break on its own.